What it do, y'all? I'm back at y'all, man, with another video today, man. I just want to start off by saying something, man. Never, never, ever, ever, ever let anyone deter you of what you want to do in life. Never. Um, don't let someone downgrade your situation. Don't let nobody hype you up either. Um, what I mean is, you know, people hate to see people succeed, no matter if it's an inch or it's a whole mile. People gonna hate on you if you're doing less than them, but happier than them. People gonna hate on you if you're doing more than them and none happier than them. It doesn't matter to people. People are still gonna hate. So that's the word of the day, man. When you live your life the way you want to live it, man. And don't let no one, and I mean no one, dictate that. You know, um, always keep your business in-house. You know, you're going through a rough time. Always take a step back, man, and take that, that extra breath. Because, boy, it could be stressful out here, man. And when you 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 run it stressful and, and you run in, you you gonna be forgetting things, you know. It might be an exit or it might come up on you too fast. Anything, and that goes to show that you're stressed out. That you need to you know get the fuck out the truck, walk around, who you mind, maybe turn your phone off. You know, if they bad news from home or arguing from home, not bad news, you know. But definitely keep updated with it. But um, yeah, man. So I wanted to start off by saying, um, I just, as I've been driving with uh, JB Hunt, man, it's it's a good ride. It's a good ride, but I got two decisions to make, and I just don't know which one. You know, I have I have good credit, okay, and I can go. I'm not saying I have went yet, but I ha I think I can go to a. a credit place and like um uh what is that uh credit union sorry there we go I got brain fart credit union and get a loan for and buy a truck be making way more money now in order for me to make that more money I might have to get on my grind like, harder than what I'm doing now you know um meaning like probably you know come home every other weekend not go home every weekend you know not be responsible obviously for everything got to find the right company and stuff like that and you know or i could just become a family man this dude just got out and like recorded me or some shit took pictures i don't know man you ever see that guy oh you probably missed him my bad you ain't see shit never mind <laughs> I don't know. It's really weird. But, um, oh, I could be the family, man, because I just had another grandbaby. Okay, uh, September 18th, 18th, uh, 17th, 16th. Maybe it was the 16th, 16th, Saturday. So, um, and Snyder has a position for which they did call me and offer me that I could be home every day and I'm just running these uh, loads for Honda. And it'll just be going from Ohio to Gary, Indiana, and then back home every day. But obviously, we know that's going to be less money. Because I think they told me it was a salary pay. I'm not quite sure. Don't get me correct. You know, don't get me wrong with that. Um, so I have a decision to make. You know, stay home. I don't have home issues like that. So, I mean, staying home is better. But where am I trying to go in my life? Am I just trying to, you know, be making it? I'm, I'm, I would be making it well there anyways. Uh, my bills are not that high anymore. Um, so I have a big decision to make. You know, I'm, I'm looking, do I want to work till I'm 67, retire? Or do I want to retire when I'm 50? That's my main goal is really to retire when I'm 50. I'm not, I'm not working brittle and bones and shit. I'm trying to be done by 50. That's 20 years of just working harder. 
you know, I've been working the last 10. I think 30 years of work it is, is enough. You know, um, and some people say, well, what do you mean by, you know, only working till you're 50? You don't live outside your means, man. I don't, I don't live outside my means. I don't do extra shit. I don't go out on vacations and spend $10,000. I don't buy hotels for no reason. Fuck, we gonna sit there and babysit the babies today. We gonna go to the movies and go out and get you something to eat. We will go on vacation. I might spend a thousand or two. One year. What the fuck? Like, I'm not doing that shit all the time. You know, I watch. I watch my money. You know, you have to. You got to pay bills off so they won't come and bite you off in the ass. You know, pay them up front so long term they won't, you know, get that shit done and over with, you know. You know what's better than money? Credit. You know, just that's all I can say, you know. I'm trying to pay my car off by the end of the next year. By the end of this year, you know. But I just wanted to, you know, just just give you guys, you know, some motivation for the day. Just to say, you know, live your life the way you want to live it. Nobody else can change it. And one thing, man, if you keep getting hit with, you know, hurdles over hurdles over hurdles. Just remember, man, God always, always, always said, I would never put you in a predicament for which you can't overcome. You're strong, you know. So, just sit back, take a, you know, that good deep breath air, and go with it, man. That's all I can say, man. Life is good, you know. Take, you know, take every breath, as, you know, take that extra breath, and and just realize, man, you 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 can make it. You can make it, man. But other than that, man, I'm out.